Are you ready? Okay, so I just did mobility, cardio, and stretching, and so it felt really good. I'm ready for this now. If not, you need to stretch out a little bit before getting into these. Now, one thing to remember is level one, you do two rounds, but so that six minutes of plank, because each round is three minutes, you can spread those out throughout the day, even 10 second planks, okay? Or, and remember, you can do them on your knees. And then just a total of 10 push ups for the entire day. So just spread it out as needed or do them all at once. Level two, you're getting in three rounds, same thing. Level three, four rounds, all at one time, spread it out. So the goal is six minutes of plank time for level one. You're going to do nine minutes of plank time for level two or 12 minutes of plank time for level three. I got my timer set for three minutes. I'm going to try to do the first round just in, in plank and not come out of it. And then after that, I'll do some pushbacks or side to sides mixed in there a little bit for it um, as needed. Try to hold the first minute of the plank, or maybe I did the first minute last time, so then I'll try to do like a minute and 15 seconds this time, something like that, before switching it out after that. And then the five push ups in between each one. Come on, we can do this, right? So I've got the timer ready. I set my timer on my, on my phone for three minutes and two seconds so I can hit the thing and get into the plank and not lose any plank time. So here we go, turn it around. Remember, in the plank, you're going to come up, you're going to shoulder back, down, tighten the whole body and hold that plank, okay? Or you can start on your knees and do the same thing. So here you can start and get into the first one. Are you ready? Three, two, one. Come back, and you're in the plank. Tighten up the body. Hold the shoulders back and down. Tighten that core. As I go back to Monday, I think about my Monday. As I always start these off, as I think about what I've done each day. I can go through them. Monday was busy. My Monday morning meeting afterwards ended up being like a marathon on a Zoom call. Our Zoom meeting with um, two of the uh, senior staff accountants that had to have sale with me as we went through some of the tax returns trying to get the people to get them in and businesses to see who was going to be primarily responsible for each one of them so we can give them a good push to try to get them all going and done and everything. And then I had a meeting Monday evening also with a new client come in and went through that. I had the cutest little baby. So cute. Made me think of my little grandson as this baby was only a little month older than him on that. So that was fun. We were over halfway, by the way. Well, hold on. Now we're halfway. <laughs> Come on, hold it tight. You got this. Monday meeting, I seem like I'm a broken record at time. Please make sure you start recording your time. Always ask them, record your time. And then uh, communicate. You're not in the office, you're not know what you're doing. So I gotta figure out how to make this work. For people that work remotely and in the office, or just remotely only, so we know what's going on. And we're all on the same page working together, right? Less than a minute for the first one. Read through it. You got this. Come on. Hold it tight. Tighten that core. Thirty seconds. Seconds. Oh, 
Oops, come on down. Okay. We gotta get the five push-ups in before we get our right. And I'm gonna do diamond. However, my diamonds turn into a heart since I messed my thumb up. Because I can't really keep my this thumb. Because a natural curve in it. <laughs> well, it wasn't a natural curve. It's called cutting your thumb really deep. And the tendon gets stuck in scar tissue. All right. Three, two, one, two. Come on, all the way down. Three, four, five. Come on up. All right. There's our first one done. We're in there. Ready for the next one? Whew. All right. All right. Let's do a stretch across first. Doesn't mean I have to rush through them, right? But I do have to get them done and get myself ready for work. And I did sleep in about, oh goodness, I think I slept in about 20 minutes this morning. <laughs> Because I knew I didn't have as much on the plate. And I wanted to get just a little bit more sleep. Because I don't want to sleep well, maybe I start off like maybe a couple hours. It's not like like three hours. But I think we're ready for this again. So remember you can drop a knee. And when you're in it, you can go side to side. So this time I'm gonna hold the first one for at least a minute and 15 seconds. I'm gonna make myself stay in at least that long. Then I might just do a push back or go to the side. Let's see. So if I go to one side, I gotta go to the other side, right? Okay. Get in there because when I hit the restart, the restart on it, it um, or pause and resume on it, it's like after three minutes. So I gotta get up and then first this time. Step back, one leg back, ready? Another leg back, draw the shoulders back, and we are in it. Draw the shoulders back and down. Tighten that core. Push into those feet. It's like the arms are still supposed to be way back there, and they're supposed to be way forward there. But right in the middle. Try to keep them down. I get to work today. I have to do my company payroll. They're going to be mad if I don't pay them time. I have to remember that. Okay. Well, all my other to do's for the day. Come on. You're just 10 seconds shy of the first minute. Over a minute. That's a minute and 20 seconds. I'm going for a minute and a half. Now I'm going to go to the side. And to the side. All right, just a little break, a little stretch, back in. Draw the shoulders back and down. Hold it. All right, we have one minute left. Take to your side. Oh. Back. 
Come on. Only 20 seconds left. Little push back. Back in with that. 10 seconds. And down. Whew, that's two down. What should we do for our push-ups this time, huh? I'm gonna do wide, but hands without the bars. So I'm just gonna, I know I have the bars out, but I'm just gonna deal with that. My hands, <clears throat> they're out there. We're gonna step it back. Wide with feet too. Roll the shoulders back and down. And one, two, three, four, and Five. There we go. Whew. Okay. Level one, by the way, you're done. Level two, you gotta give me one more. Oh, level three, you're halfway. All right. A little drink. Am I procrastinating? Maybe just a little. Mm. So. I'm going to hold the first one again like I've been doing. I asked for max. We made it a minute and a half. Halfway through it. <laughs> Let's see what we can do this time. I um, might not make it that long. We'll see. But um, we're going to get in there. Hold the first plank as long as possible. And then either push it back or go to the side. Maybe do like I did last time. Mm. Pull back a second here. Pull for it. Push back. Ready for it. I think I'm ready now. Are you ready? Down. Down. Step back. Step back. Draw the shoulders back. Tighten the core and resume. We're in it. Come on. My booty's a little bit too hot there. There we go. So think about how much, like you can't do it. Think about what you can do it. Think about other things. Sometimes I like to read when I'm doing these things. Scroll a little bit. Do different things to kind of get my mind off of it. When I do them live, sometimes it's fun because I can chat with somebody while I'm doing it. And it really keeps my mind off of it. But, Whew, come on. Over the first minute. All right, it's a minute and 20 seconds down so far. I'm going to go for the full minute and a half again. Three, two, one, side action. Oh, Tug the Use a break. Pull it over. Oh, ready to come back down. It's 10 seconds on the side. Back down again. Draw the shoulders back. Taking it over, other side, up we go. Cat side of the couch, it's so cute. And back down again, that was 10 seconds on that side. 40 seconds left.
push back. Oh. And forward. Ten seconds, come on. Three down, level two. You gotta give me push up still. What are we gonna do? Okay, ready for push ups. Hands are down. Could do the reverse push ups. I don't think so though. I'm not going to get into those. Those are going to be too much for my wrist, I think. <sighs> Regular. They're there. We're stepping it back. Draw the shoulders back. Five of them. Come all the way down. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Pull aside. We got one more to go. It's like Larry Chow, it's gonna take me at least 20 minutes to get through, huh? Ah. Ah. Bruce. Not quite sure what I did. You ever do that? It's gonna go like, where'd that bruise go from? Ah, other side. We could do this. Could we procrastinate for a while or just get into it. I think I'm just gonna get into it because I'm already looking at over 20 minutes because right now it's already 17 minutes in. And it gets done. All right. One more time. All right. Come on, we could do this. Down, down. Remember, you can always drop a knee too. And resume it. Work in it. Draw the shoulders back and down. Actively pull them down. Tighten that core. Almost to the first minute. One minute down, two to go. One minute, 15 seconds down. Five minute and a half. Whew. Okay. So I held it more like 15 seconds. <laughs> Draw back. Take it to the side. And come on back.
Come on, 10 seconds. Okay, we're going to push the silver, pull back. Oh, okay. Diamond or heart like I like to say them because that's where my hands go. We're going to do two, three, four, and then the fifth one regular, okay? Now, I say don't cheat on them, come all the way down, but if you cannot come all the way down, that is perfectly fine. Go down as far as you can. Draw the shoulders back and down. Three, two, one, two. Drop them. Hands come out. Bring it forward. Step it back. Score the shoulders back and down. And three, four, step them in, step back, five. Oh, come on up, pull back. Forward. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Come on, oh, please make sure you stretch out after that. Okay. Work through them. I know. Get ready for work. It was a lot of fun. Oh, did you hear me say it's time to get ready for work? He's moving around now. Normally, he used to come down when I started, started the planks, but he's Mr. Old Lazy Cat. He just wants to lay around and smoosh my couch cushions down. That's what he likes to do. So, whatever you did, whatever variation, however you did them, get the time in. Remember, spread it out. You don't have to do them all at once. You can spread them out throughout the day and get them done just the same. This one here is checked off. Done.